Life is all about acceptance and adjustment, and Hostel Lives is a suitable place to master this art. Thereby, I invite our junior brother, Aditya Basu of Class 11, to share his views as a Vidya Pitian on the behalf of whole Class 11th. Revered Secretary Maharaj, Revered Principal Maharaj, Revered Coordinator Maharaj, Revered Chief Warden Maharaj, and other revered monks and brahmacharyans of Sri Ramakrishna Order, affectionate teachers, my senior brothers, and my dear friends. Thank you, seniors, for your loving, caring, and motivational words to us. We do appreciate your words of guidance for us. We greatly value them. We promise that we will hold our reward monks, brahmacharyans, teachers, and seniors in great respect and follow their instructions and directions closely and keep the flag of Ramkrish Mission Vidyapeet at the zenith. All of us are enthralled by the serene and alluring campus of Vidyapeet. Upon our arrival here at the very outset, we felt homesick and were very emotional and were much worried to think of how we could spend the rest of our days here away from our parents and family. However, within the very first few days of our stay here, we have begun to feel settled and duly felt that we have left one home to stay at another home. We are able to control our emotions and worries. Following our schedule pleasurably, we find ourselves extremely lucky and exuberant now. We were truly born under a lucky star to get an opportunity to study at such an exemplary institution, which is a treasure of goodness and selflessness, where a very tranquil, quiet, disciplined, and beautiful atmosphere is being provided. We are fortunate enough to be matured here under the guidance of loving monks, brahmacharyans, and acclaimed teachers, all of whom work selflessly and tirelessly to promote Swami Vivekananda's vision of the man-making and character-building education. They epitomize three Ds, that is, dedication, determination, devotion. They are the truest keepers of Atmano Mokshartam Jagat Hitayacha, which means for one's own salvation and for the welfare of the world. According to Swami Vivekananda, weakness is the main cause of immorality evil and suffering in life. And the cause of this weakness is ignorance about one's own true potential. And as Thomas Elva Edison has rightly said, if you did the things we are capable of, we would astound ourselves. And believe me, my fellow mates, we have entered the true heaven of learning where we are going to get a chance to improve academically, spiritually, intellectually, and basically in all aspects of life. We find ourselves exceedingly fortunate to study here, because everything about this place is indeed the most eloquent expression of what Bhagwan Sri Ramkrishna really preached. So, on behalf of the freshers, today I'm absolutely confident in saying that our parents have made the most appropriate decision in admitting us into this sanctified, eminent, and metamorphosis center of converting cocoons into butterflies. Concluding my speech, I would like to say that we are deeply touched and God gifted to be a member of this institution. Thank you and obeisance to all. Aditya Basu ke kathan ko sunkar atyadik harsh ho raha hai ki ve itne kam samay mein vidyapit ke parivar mein sammalit ho gaye. 